guys, Cal here. I'm in fish camp here. I'm in our easy up. And uh, I've had a lot of guys reach out and ask me how I eat trout. You know, I barbecue it. Sometimes I fry it. A lot of times I'll take trout and I'll smoke it, which is what I did here. I'm going to make dinner out of some smoked trout. This was inspired by Jordan over on the Addicted Fishing channel on YouTube. Um, he made this awesome uh, grilled salmon sandwich the other day with canned salmon and a bunch of ingredients. So I'm going to do something very similar, but I just want to toss out that he definitely inspired this. It looks so good. And uh, I wanted to try it myself. I had a fella give me a big trout filet the other day. We got a big trout and uh, he didn't think him and his wife could eat it all. So he asked me if I wanted one of the filets. It was bright red. It was beautiful. I took it home. I smoked it and I have a piece here, probably I'm gonna say nine or 10 ounces of smoked trout. Um, I uh, I cured it with Kevin Brock's um, smoking preparation. I let it sit in that overnight. I rinsed it. I added some cracked pepper. I added a little bit of salt and uh, I smoked it for about five hours. I had a couple, couple days off this week. So I got out the little chief. Um, I used apple wood um, for the smoke and uh, it came out just absolutely beautiful. So I'm going to make a salad out of that, which I'm going to ultimately heat up. I'm going to add some, some pickled jalapenos, some dried cranberries, um, some garlic, some sriracha sauce, a little bit of mayo, and uh, and about a third of a red onion. So let me get to chopping, let me get all the ingredients together, and uh, then we'll head on over to the Coleman stove and we'll, we'll put it all together. And I'm gonna make two big old grilled uh, trout sandwiches on sourdough bread. I'm gonna put some cheddar cheese in there, I'm gonna melt everything together, and it's gonna be phenomenal. So let me get started chopping and uh, I'll join you back over here at the Coleman stove. First thing I'm going to do is heat up the salad portion of this. I've got a little mayo in there to just add a little oil to it. So we'll get that going. And uh, once that's going good, we'll move it over to the, the second burner over there and we'll get started toasting the bread. Okay guys, they're getting close. They're a little burned, but hey, this is grilled cheese on a Coleman stove. So it's it's a bit of a learning curve. This is my second attempt, but uh, I think it is time to pull those off there. I learned something else too. I put these on one of those, um, one of those styrofoam, uh, you know, paper plates and uh, it melted the plate. So I'm gonna put them on my cutting board. We'll get back in the easy up. I'll cut these in half and uh, dinner is served. Okay, guys, there they are. I am coming off like a 20 hour fast. Um, I've been doing some dieting. I'm trying to consume all my calories in about a two hour window. And uh, man, I just tasted the filling. It's spicy. It's, it's, it's rich with the trout flavor. It is absolutely phenomenal. I'm going to dig into this and... Uh, I will catch you next time right here on YouTube. This is a great way to to, to use your smoked trout. Um, man, I wish you had smell o vision <laughs> Anyway, I'm Kel Kellogg. I'm going to eat this up. I will catch you next time right here on YouTube, guys. Thanks a ton.